Hi everyone, this is Sybil. Welcome to my channel. I'm here to share with you guys some wonderful, amazing, happy mail that arrived today from my dear sweet friend, Tina, the Crafty Bean. Tina, oh my goodness gracious, you have spoiled me rotten. Tina um, knew that I was looking for the Snow and Cocoa chipboard and so she sent me a message and said that she wanted to send that to me and I said no I don't want you to spend your money on me I said um, that's okay you know but thank you so much and she said no I want to I want to send you happy mail and I said well let me pay for it and pay for the shipping but she would have nothing to do with that so this bunch of goodness arrived today and so I want to share it with you. First, I want you to see this beautiful card that she made. It's my very first Christmas card that I've received. And she put her hand stamp back there. It says, Created by Tina Kappa. And this is a La La Land image, Marcy, that she has colored so sweetly. And she's got some sparkle. I hope that you guys can see that it's on the bow and then some on the flowers as well. I love the plaid paper and the gingham bow there and the two doilies and she's inked around this one and then these flowers, they're so pretty. And it's an easel card, you guys, look at this. And it says Merry Christmas. And doesn't that match beautifully with her little outfit? I love it. Thank you so much, Tina. And she wrote me a note and said that she knew I was looking for the Snow and Cocoa chipboard, but she wanted to send me not only that, but some other goodies that she knew I would have fun playing with. So big, big thank you so, so much, Tina. And before I go into this, let me share that she sent me the Spectrum Noir Sparkle um, Clear Transplant transparent it's a liquid and it's what you find in your sparkle pen which I love my spectrum noir sparkle pen and she wrote to me and shared that I can either pour this into the pen that I have you know like when it's empty or I can dip my brush in this and then apply it to flowers which is what I think she did to the beautiful flowers on the card because they really sparkle so thank you so much, Tina. That's so thoughtful. I remember watching your video where you shared um, that you had picked up a couple of those. Okay, so here is the snow and cocoa goodness that she sent me. She sent me this um, ephemera. Really, really cute. I love it. I just love this paper line. It's so whimsical and I love the colors. Really pretty. I did not have this. The puffy stickers, oh, I love them, so cute. Nor did I have the garlands, the wreaths, but I do now, thank you, Tina. And you guys, here's the chipboard, but look what she did. She didn't send me one, she sent me two of them. Oh my stars, I could not believe it. <laughs> and oh, I just love this, look at the little birdies. They are so cute and whimsical, wearing their scarves and their hats and their sweaters. I love everything about this. Look at the jar with the deer and the trees. I'm sure you guys have seen this, but I have the big 12 by 12 paper pad and I think I have some ephemera and that's it. My store just does not have hardly any Christmas stuff. And speaking of Christmas, she sent me some other Christmas goodies. This is Winterberry from My Mind's Eye. And I want you to see a couple of, all of it is really, really pretty. It's double-sided and it's got lots of plaid. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? So you've got the house, well, you've got houses and like a little lake and a deer and the trees and the church. It's such a pretty scene, but look at this. Here it is in dark colors. It's so beautiful and more plaid, buffalo plaid and stripes and snowflakes. I love this. Thank you, Tina. And this is a new to me line. I've never heard of Winterberry that I know of. Um, so really pretty. And here's some ephemera 
from that same line. Really beautiful. I love this. This is going to be fun to play with. And look at this. She sent me this Story of Fall by Lori Whitlock, chipboard. Hey there, Foxy. Super cute. And Have Faith chipboard accents. And I love this. I love the beautiful colors and a lot of the scripture text here on the um, chipboard is really neat. Love that. Thank you, thank you. Now, I wanted to show you all this other goodness that she sent, and I've got these stickers here because I found this at my Tuesday morning, and it was the first time I'd heard of our Auburn Lane from Pink Paisley, and I just loved these colors and thought it was such a pretty line, and that's pretty much what I could find from them. But look what Tina sent me, Auburn Lane. So I've got embellishments here, the little hearts and, um, and gold and pink and the enamel dots, and then a sequin mix and gold, um, rose gold pins, uh, paper clips. Super cute, thank you, Tina. And then puffy stickers. I love this line, you guys. This has gotta be, I don't even know how old it is, because like I said, I've never heard of it before, but it is beautiful. I'm gonna see if I, I can find more of this somewhere, because it is gorgeous. Thank you, thank you, Tina. And then she sent me two Maggie Holmes um, stickers, puffy stickers, and what is this one called? Chasing Dreams, I was gonna say that, but I thought I better check really beautiful. I love the colors in this line. Beautiful. And Jen Hadfield, homemade. So she sent me this. Um, I didn't open this paper pad. I'd open the other one to look at it. But here are some of the papers in the line. You can see them there in the paper pad. Really, really pretty. I love this. And look at all this other goodness she sent. Ephemera, well, I should turn it over. Beautiful, beautiful, with a bunch of foil, gold foil accents. And then do you guys remember if you watched my one Tuesday morning haul, I said I was thrilled to get these stickers. And then when I got it home, the Y was missing. Well, Tina took care of that for me. <laughs> she gave me two of them. Thank you so much, Tina. Oh my goodness. I love the homemade line. And speaking of homemade, here is the chipboard stickers to this. It's so pretty. Oh my goodness. It's so lovely. I love the colors to that. And of course the house. And then here, this is homemade as well. And I'm kind of wondering, because the colors are different, are they for different seasons? Is this for like spring and this summer? That's what I'm kind of thinking. Because this one has the lemons. This has the flowers and the bird's nest with the little eggs in them. And then the bicycle there. This is really beautiful. I love this. And then here's another one, and it's also called Homemade. So I don't know, this, is, this seems like summer as well with the, with the berries and the peacock. I love the um, Volkswagen bug there with flowers coming up, it's so beautiful. Thank you, Tina, for blessing me with all these beautiful gifts and goodness and your beautiful card. I love it and every time I see it, I will think of you. Thank you, Tina, for being a dear friend, not because you've sent me all of this, but because of your friendship. I cherish you and I am so thankful that the Lord brought us together in this crafty community. We've been good friends, I think it's been like five years now and we share our hearts, our dreams, and we laugh together. Oh my goodness, you guys, do we ever laugh. I love you, Tina. God bless you. Thank you, everyone, for watching. Please go over and check out Tina's channel. I will have the link to her channel in the description box. Thank you again, my sweet friend. God bless. Bye for now.